The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, New Orleans District, constructed the Seabrook Gate Complex uh, as part of the overall hurricane and storm damage risk reduction system. Uh, over my right shoulder, you can see uh, the vertical lift gate, uh, which is part of the Seabrook Gate Complex. The overall system for the HSDRS cost roughly $14.5 billion. Uh, the Seabrook Gate Complex was about, one, about $165 million of that budget. The Seabrook Gate Complex was designed to stop storm surge from Lake Pontchartrain entering into the Inner Harbor Navigation Canal. During Isaac, uh, the entire perimeter system was used. Uh, the Seabrook Gate Complex was closed, both the sector gate and the vertical lift gates. Uh, it functioned exactly how it was designed, uh, flawlessly, uh, so we're very happy with, with, uh, with the design and the project as a whole. You know, one thing that we've tried to do throughout the whole construction effort is um, assist the local sponsor who is ultimately going to take this over, being the state of Louisiana, uh, in reducing their maintenance costs through whatever construction means we could. Um, all the metal you see that's exposed is either aluminum, galvanized, or stainless steel, uh, so their, their maintenance costs are, are lowered. Um, this was one of the last projects that we awarded, um, so we took some of the lessons learned in, in the other construction projects uh, and built them into this. The uh, vertical lift gates, the, the towers are concrete versus steel, which we did in the past. Um, again, that's, all these measures were, were constructed uh, to reduce the future maintenance costs of the state so that they can continue to have a functioning and working system well into the future.